physical attributes of Hazrat Mahdi alayhi salam. Hazrat Mahdi alayhi salam is a man of medium height. Hazrat Mahdi alayhi salam will be a man of medium height. Hazrat Mahdi's alayhi salam shoulders are wide. Hazrat Mahdi's alayhi salam shoulders are wide. The bone of the shoulder cap of Hazrat Mahdi alayhi salam will be tender and the distance between the shoulders is wide. Hazrat Mahdi's alayhi salam belly is wide. His Hazrat Mahdi's alayhi salam belly is wide. The structure of Hazrat Mahdi's alayhi salam legs, his entire body will be wide. Hazrat Mahdi's legs are wide and large. Hazrat Mahdi's alayhi salam thighs are wide. There is a space between his Hazrat Mahdi's alayhi salam two thighs. Hazrat Mahdi's alayhi salam forehead is open and wide. Mahdi is of my descent. He has a wide forehead. Almighty God will send a son, Hazrat Mahdi alayhi salam, of my ummah, with a wide forehead, who will fill the earth with justice and distribute the possessions without weighing or counting them. Hazrat Mahdi alayhi salam has a wide face. He, Hazrat Mahdi alayhi salam, is a young man with a wide and beautiful face, who has beautiful hair and a thin nose. Hazrat Mahdi alayhi salam has a large head. He, Hazrat Mahdi alayhi salam, is a young man with a wide face. Hazrat Mahdi alayhi salam is of my descent. His forehead is large. As is evident from the hadith of our Prophet, sallallahu alayhi wasallam, the forehead and face of Hazrat Mahdi alayhi salam are wide, and thus he has a large head. Hazrat Mahdi's alayhi salam shoulders are majestic. Our Prophet sallallahu alayhi wasallam said, Hazrat Mahdi's alayhi salam shoulders are as sturdy as a rock. Hazrat Mahdi alayhi salam has a beautiful face. It is narrated from Imam Hussein. When Hazrat Mahdi alayhi salam appears, the people will not recognize him. Indeed, he, Hazrat Mahdi alayhi salam, will come as a person with a beautiful face. Humran bin Ayan narrates, Your owner Hazrat Mahdi alayhi salam has a wide belly. There is a mark on his forehead. His face is beautiful. Hazrat Mahdi's alayhi salam face has holy light. His face is radiant like a shining star. Hazrat Mahdi alayhi salam is a beautiful young man. He has a beautiful face. His radiance rises up to his hair. Hazrat Mahdi alayhi salam has a face that is peaceful and gives peace. Aga Sayyid Hassan, a prominent poet, told the following about Hazrat Mahdi alayhi salam. The beauty of Hazrat Mahdi rises from his beautiful face. The morning breeze spreads from his peace-giving face. Hazrat Mahdi's alayhi salam face is magnificent. Our Prophet sallallahu alayhi wasallam said, His face is full of magnificence and the light of chastity. He has the appearance of a glorious leader. Hazrat Mahdi alayhi salam has slanting eyes. Humran bin Ayan says, I told Imam Muhammad Bakir, Hazrat Mahdi alayhi salam has slanting eyes. Hazrat Mahdi alayhi salam will have green eyes. He, Hazrat Mahdi alayhi salam, is a young man with green eyes, curved eyebrows and a snub nose. He, Hazrat Mahdi alayhi salam, is a young man with green eyes. Hazrat Mahdi's alayhi salam nose is beautiful, small and fine. His forehead is wide and nose will be slender. He, Hazrat Mahdi alayhi salam, has a wide forehead and thin nose. Hazrat Mahdi alayhi salam is a person with a small nose. Our Prophet sallallahu alayhi wasallam said, Hazrat Mahdi has a thin and beautiful nose. There is a slight protrusion in the middle of Hazrat Mahdi's alayhi salam nose. Hazrat Mahdi's nose is small, and there is a very small protrusion in the middle of it. 
Hazrat Madis alayhi salam eyebrows are curved. His eyebrows are curved. There will be a dip between his eyebrows. There is a small dip between his eyebrows. In this hadith of our Prophet sallallahu alayhi wasallam, it is stated that there is a natural dip, a single one, between his two eyebrows. Hazrat Madis alayhi salam cheeks are less full. The Messenger of God sallallahu alayhi wasallam decreed, his cheeks seem to be less full, and when he is sleepless, he sometimes looks pale. There is a mark, scar, on the forehead of Hazrat Mahdi alayhi salam. Humran bin Ayan says, I told Imam Muhammad Bakar, Hazrat Mahdi alayhi salam will have a mark on his forehead and a mole on his face. Hazrat Mahdi alayhi salam will have a slight concavity to his forehead. His Hazrat Mahdi's alayhi salam hair is thick, his forehead is broad, and there is a slight concavity to his forehead. Hazrat Madi's alayhi salam forehead will be bright like the rest of his complexion. Abu Sayyid al Hudri, it is narrated from Allah's Messenger. Surely Almighty God will send a person with a bright forehead from my descent, and he will fill the earth with justice, relief, and economic equality. There is a mole on Hazrat Madi's alayhi salam cheek. There is a mole on his face. There is a sign mole on his cheek resembling a pearl. It brightens his face like a star. The mole on Hazrat Madi's cheek protrudes like the mole on Prophet Moses alayhi salam cheek. The mole on Hazrat Madi alayhi salam protrudes like the mole on Prophet Moses alayhi salam cheek and it is bright like a star. His complexion is bright. There are two moles on Hazrat Madi's alayhi salam body which are exactly the same with the ones our Prophet Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam had. Narrated from Abu Jafar, Imam Muhammad Bakir. In the end times, a person of my descent, Hazrat Madi Alaihi Salam, will appear. He will have two moles, the color of our Prophet. In between the two shoulders of Hazrat Madi Alaihi Salam, on his right chest, there is a big dark brown mole, shaped like a leaf. Imam Muhammad Bakir or Imam Jafar as Sadiq said, There are two portents of Hazrat Mahdi alayhi salam. In between his shoulders, there will be a black leaf similar to a basil leaf. There is a seal of prophethood on the shoulder of Hazrat Mahdi alayhi salam. On the shoulder of Hazrat Mahdi alayhi salam, there will be the seal of prophethood like our Prophet sallallahu alayhi wasallam had. On the shoulder of Hazrat Mahdi alayhi salam, there is the seal of prophethood. The teeth of Hazrat Mahdi alayhi salam are beautiful and bright. His teeth will be bright. In another hadith, Hazrat Ali related thus, The front teeth of Hazrat Mahdi are bright. The complexion of Hazrat Mahdi alayhi salam is bright. The face of Hazrat Mahdi alayhi salam shines like golden bronze. It is so bright that his actual color will almost not be seen. The complexion of Hazrat Mahdi alayhi salam is the color of Arabs, reddish white. The color of Hazrat Mahdi alayhi salam is the color of Arabs. The complexion color of the Arab race is reddish white. This was also the color of our Prophet sallallahu alayhi wasallam, but the revealed parts of his complexion were brownish because of the effect of factors like sun and wind. From the reports, it is understood that the complexion of Hazrat Mahdi alayhi salam will be the same as the color of our Prophet sallallahu alayhi wasallam. The blessed color of our Prophet sallallahu alayhi wasallam was reddish white. Anas ibn Malik said the following about the color of our Prophet sallallahu alayhi wasallam. He was white, but that white was brownish. Our Prophet sallallahu alayhi wasallam was pinkish white. Abu Jafar, Imam Muhammad Bakr alayhi salam narrated, In the end times a person of my descent, Hazrat Mahdi alayhi salam, will appear. 
he will be a person of reddish-white complexion. The skin color of Hazrat Mahdi, alayhi salam. It is sometimes white, sometimes dark. The hair of Hazrat Mahdi, alayhi salam, is black. The light of his face rises above the blackness of his hair. He has black hair. He has a black beard. The light of his face shines like a day on the blackness of his hair, beard and head, and gives him grandeur. The hair of Hazrat Mahdi alayhi salam will attract attention with its beauty. He, Hazrat Mahdi alayhi salam, is a person of medium height. He has a beautiful face and has beautiful hair. The hair of Hazrat Mahdi alayhi salam has curls above the ear. Our Prophet sallallahu alayhi wasallam related, the hair of Hazrat Mahdi alayhi salam has curls above the ear. The beard of Hazrat Mahdi alayhi salam will be copious and thick. His, Hazrat Mahdi's alayhi salam, beard will be copious and thick. Hazrat Mahdi alayhi salam will have a beard that is smoothed, sparsely bearded at the sides. A man of average height, dark, mahtum, having a beard shape that is smoothed, longer downwards compared to the sides. Kausash, sparsely bearded at the sides. Hazrat Mahdi's alayhi salam body is very strong. The promised Kaim, Hazrat Mahdi alayhi salam, he is so powerful that if he stretches his hand to the largest tree in the world, he will uproot it and cast it away. Hazrat Mahdi alayhi salam has a very powerful voice. The promised Kaim, Hazrat Mahdi alayhi salam, is so powerful that if he shouts among the mountains, hard rocks will turn into powder. Hazrat Mahdi's alayhi salam voice is breathtaking. Our Prophet sallallahu alayhi wasallam said, the voice of Hazrat Mahdi alayhi salam is powerful and breathtaking. Hazrat Mahdi alayhi salam will have a very powerful body and his muscles will be strong. Our Prophet sallallahu alayhi wasallam stated, the muscles of Hazrat Mahdi alayhi salam are strong. Hazrat Mahdi alayhi salam is majestic like the Prophet's. Narrated from Abdullah ibn Zamra ibn Mati Himyara Kub ul Ahbar. Hazrat Mahdi alayhi salam, who will stand up, God will grant the majesty he grants to the prophets also to him. Hazrat Mahdi alayhi salam looks like the Prophet Jesus alayhi salam in appearance. Narrated from Abdullah ibn Zamra ibn Mati Himyari Kub al Ahbar. Hazrat Mahdi alayhi salam who will stand up. He is the one who looks like Prophet Jesus alayhi salam in appearance and morality. Hazrat Mahdi alayhi salam will be around 30 years old when he starts his activities. He will be sent when he is around 30 to 40 years old. Hazrat Mahdi alayhi salam is one of my descendants. Hazrat Mahdi alayhi salam will have a youthful face even in advancing years. And one of his portents will be his not growing old by the passing of days and nights. He will be long-lived and have a youthful face. People who see him will think he is a man aged around 40, and he will not age until God's command arrives. The promised Kain, Hazrat Mahdi alayhi salam, will appear in his advanced years, but in a young appearance. Hazrat Mahdi alayhi salam, bone structure is young. The tip bone of his, Hazrat Mahdi alayhi salam, shoulder is mild. Hazrat Mahdi alayhi salam's kneecaps protrude. His Hazrat Mahdi alayhi salam, two kneecaps protrude. There is a black mark on the right leg of Hazrat Mahdi alayhi salam. There is a black mark on Hazrat Mahdi's alayhi salam right leg. The gate of Hazrat Mahdi alayhi salam. As he walks, there is a space between his thighs and they are at a distance from one another. While he speaks, there exists some severity in the tongue of Hazrat Mahdi alayhi salam. There is severity in his tongue. While speaking, Hazrat Mahdi alayhi salam uses his right hand to emphasize. When he speaks, slowly and weightily, he will hit his left knee with his right hand. 
Hazrat Madis alayhi salam eyes are impressive. Our Prophet sallallahu alayhi wasallam told, He has the appearance of a glorious leader. His eyes are different, his voice is strong and breathtaking. Hazrat Madis alayhi salam lips are very beautiful. His appearance is very magnificent. Our Prophet sallallahu alayhi wasallam said, Hazrat Madis alayhi salam his lips are perfect and beautiful. His appearance is good and handsome. His face is full of magnificence with the light of chastity. He has the appearance of a magnificent leader. Hazrat Madi alayhi salam has an attraction that evokes admiration. Your owner, Hazrat Madi alayhi salam, has a wide belly and he has an attraction that evokes admiration. Hazrat Madi alayhi salam will be recognized by our prophets sallallahu alayhi wasallam descriptions about him. Abul Jarud tells to Imam Muhammad Bakir, how is Imam Hazrat Madi recognized? With his guidance and grandeur and our prophets sallallahu alayhi wasallam confirmation of his virtues. Haris ibn Mughar Nasri says to Imam Jafari Sadiq, how is the Imam recognized? With his grandeur and dignity. What else? By his knowing what is unlawful and lawful, people's need of him, and his not being in need of anyone else. <laughs>